Hi, my name is Dave Knight, founder and broker of RentSmart USA. And today's video is going to be about the tax advantages for investment property owners. And here are the top eight tax deductions. Number one, insurance. The premiums you pay for rental property can be deducted, including fire, death, flood, and liability insurance. Number two, interest. See, you can deduct the interest on your mortgage or the interest on a credit card for the expenses of property management purposes. So the mortgage interest is, is often the single largest deduction that you can make. And let's face it, when you take out a 30 year mortgage, the first 15 years on your payments are pretty much interest. Number three, legal and professional services. You can deduct legal, accounting, and real estate advisory fees as operating expenses. And say you're a member at a local real estate club and or what, we, what we call a RIA. Yes, you can deduct your membership dues too. And if you have to evict the tenant, the attorney fees, you can deduct that too. Number four, maintenance. So when the tenant's toilet backs up in the middle of the night and you get that call at 2 a.m. and you call a plumber to go out and do the job, that's tax deductible. But your time isn't tax deductible but we won't get to that. <laughs> so also tax deductible is the painting of the property, rekeying of the locks, cleaning in between tenants, and most general repairs along with the cost of labor. Not your labor, but the labor of a handyman. So you're really not saving money doing it yourself. Hire somebody. Number five, advertising fees. So when you pay a photographer to take photos of the property, tax deductible. And when you pay those fees to advertise on the internet, tax deductible. Number six, depreciation. I love this one. It's one of the best deductions in the IRS code. See, you get to deduct a certain percentage of your property through lost value. It's called depreciation. And your property is losing value every day because of natural wear and tear caused by weather, tenants, time, decay, and obsolescence. Now, Unfortunately, the IRS doesn't allow land to be depreciated, but the good news is that you can take this deduction for 27 and a half years for residential property and 39 years for commercial property. Number seven, travel. I love this one. So you can travel anywhere in the world and find one thing. And that one thing is real estate. <laughs> I'm, I'm not saying that you can write off a cruise to the Bahamas, but you know, if you travel to any local or long distance property, that's tax deductible. You get to deduct the mileage. And uh, well, the airfare that you spend to go to a real estate conference, tax deductible. And so is a hotel room in the meals you eat. What a country. Number eight, property management fees. Why do it yourself when you can hire a property manager to do it for you? So when you hire a manager to place a tenant, to do all the paperwork, to do the inspections, to do the rent collection, to do the accounting, to do the maintenance, most importantly, to get you paid, it's all tax deductible. You see, in the IRS code, there is no better deductions than investment property. Own investment properties, you get the best tax deductions. So you gotta be smart and rent smart. Rent Smart USA.